What's going on guys? Wanna shoot a quick little video here on how I use, how I uh, charge AC units with my Sporlin uh, smart probes. As you can see I got my temperature clamps. I got my probes. What I like doing guys is I like using a um, a T and I'll use a six inch hose with a ball valve at the end. And on that T, you can see one side here, I got it tied into the system. The other side, the second side of the T, I got it hooked up to my probe. In this case, my low side probe. And then on the third T over here, I got a ball valve and it's hooked up to my drum right in there. So what I do is, um, I already got the system charged up, so I'm not going to open up the ball valve to show you exactly, but basically I just crack open the uh, the ball valve and, um, you know, meter the gas through here into the system. Pretty straightforward, pretty basic. All I got to bring is my smart probes, my six-inch hose. I usually use this just in case I can't get to, like in this case, it's pretty tight on this old train unit. How to putting in your, your uh, probes in there. And um, you just use a T, and you just add gas to the third T with a you know, by the ball valve. So uh, I know I've had a couple comments. Some guy, some of my subs were uh, asking me how I charge up systems with the smart probes since they're hoseless and wireless. And this is how I do it, guys. Pretty straightforward, simple, pretty quick and easy to set up, and uh, pretty convenient. Alright, just want to show you a little video on that. See you on the next one.